When you're a plus size person, it can be hard to find clothes with style that actually fit. Luckily, some companies are beginning to address this issue by designing clothing that not only looks good, but fits you just right. With the release of their new extended size line featuring sizes to 4X and 54 waist, Bonobos is doing exactly that. I'm here in New York City at Bonobos HQ to learn more about how the company is making clothes specifically for bigger bodies. First, we'll meet with Bonobo CEO, Mickey Anvaral, to learn more about the brand itself. Hello. Hi, Bruce. I'm Mickey. Nice well, to meet you. Welcome to Bonobos. Thank you. Thank you very much. It's cool to be here and actually see where everything is made, and I'm excited to learn more about extended sizes. Can you tell me a little about Bonobos for people who might not be aware of the brand? Yeah, so we design, make, and sell better fitting men's clothing in short. So we started back in 2007 um, with this quest to banish khaki diaper butt. That's to say really poor fitting men's pants. And since then we've really evolved to offer better fitting men's clothing across every category. So that's suits, blazers, jeans, shorts, swim and even underwear. So it's been quite the journey and we can now fit a man head to toe. And our goal is really to make men feel great about what they're wearing, both because of the fit, but also because of the style that they can create, which is sort of personalized to them. I love the fit and the style and fit seems to be so important to the brand. How does that work into how you've created extended sizes? Yeah, so we really went and looked and talked to men about sort of the challenges that they were finding in finding really great fitting clothing. And we found this was a really underserved audience. So we set out to really super serve them. So that meant really taking everything that we know about fit and what makes great fitting men's clothing and really build on that and tweak it for this audience so that they could feel as good as everybody else about how they, they look and about the fit. I love that. And uh, I can definitely say, as you see, I'm wearing an outfit here. Uh, everything fits me well. And being able to put something on that not just covers your body, but fits you the way that it's supposed to, it's huge. So I'm excited to learn more about the process and kind of walk through all of that. Great. Well, let's take you to Kate and she can tell you all about that. So. It's evident by looking at the clothes and wearing them that a lot of thought went into the, the design process and really just uh, the entire creation of extended sizes. Can you talk to me a little bit about uh, what went into that and kind of where you started? Yeah, sure. So we had done some third party research um, back in the early fall of last year, kind of just exploring opportunities for bonobos in general. Um, and there were a couple different ideas thrown at the wall, but one of the ones that we were most excited about because we felt like it kind of sat with how the brand had originated to begin with was extended sizing. Um, and one of the reasons that was recommended is because it is a market that is growing, outpacing the total men's market. So of course that was exciting as well. And then from there, we really took kind of, um, a, I guess, more of a social angle in doing some more um, demographic research and then working with our research team to actually visit two different cities and interview people both in person and over the phone about you know shopping preferences shopping challenges um, you know experiences that may have been frustrating in the past or um, things that they were looking for um, you know just to kind of build that foundation of a new customer that we hadn't necessarily been speaking to directly in the past and we wanted to be really thoughtful about not only the the product that we were launching but also the experience for those customers and kind of take learning from past shopping experiences to, to hopefully offer something better. I love the prints and I mean this, it's wonderful. So it's fun to be able to have these because you don't find them very often, mm -hmm. so. And what we try to do fresh hits of that really every month with the idea that, you know, people are checking back almost like a sneaker drop, kind of seeing what, what prints we're coming out with next. Um, awesome. So that'll be a fun journey over time to see what resonates with people. I love that you put so much thought into fit and making it something that actually uh, works with your body. It's not even that we're doing something special. I think it's more that people just never gave any thought to it before. We are very used to finding clothes, finding one thing that fits somewhat well and holding on to it for dear life. So, <laughs> so it's exciting to know that we don't necessarily have to do that because you're going to continue to put things out that we actually yeah. want to wear. And we're continuing to put out to work on new fits. We're already working on our next body type. So I think the first body type was more kind of a proportional larger. So your chest is larger, your shoulders are larger, your belly's larger. Um, our next fit I think will be kind of a larger belly in relationship to like your shoulders. So, um, so if what you're finding 
right now isn't right for your body type, I, our whole mission is to fit all the different body types. And this isn't going to be like a one size fits all fit that we're coming out with. This is one body type and then we're going to address the next body type, but we just can't rush it. That's why we started with one. Sure, you've got to do it right. But the fact that you're going to do more body types, that's awesome. That's yeah. so it's sorely needed. I've got a great team, Stephanie and James will probably walk you through all the details. Um, I've been working at Bonobos for about eight and a half years now. And across my eight and a half years, I've managed a bunch of different categories, but right now I'm focusing on suiting, blazers, um, denim, and a couple other categories, but for this, mainly suiting and blazers. Nice, okay. And so when you approached uh, doing extended sizes uh, for those pieces, what was different in doing that uh, for bigger sizes as opposed to uh, medium or large? Well, it was interesting because it wasn't just a matter of making our normal size medium bigger to make it the larger sizes. We actually had to do a couple tweaks for specific body types. So our unconstructed blazer in particular is a very lightweight fabric. It's almost like a mesh through the chest panel here. And one of the best parts about it is it's super lightweight. You can just throw it in your bag, throw it over your shoulder. It's always nice. But for guys, let's say, who carry their weight a little lower, there's more shape in the body. So we needed to take out some of that excess ease through the chest panel here. So by doing a fisheye dart, which is essentially just taking in more ease in the middle than at either ends, we are able to shape that much nicer through the chest. Whereas with someone who carries their weight up top, mm -hmm. it would just fill it out naturally. So one other tweak that we're really proud of is our suit pant. We, since we're only offering our even sizes in our pants, and with the main line we offer every size, mm -hmm. we wanted to give a little adjustment to the pants here so that, let's say, you are potentially in between sizes. You can still buy down a size and expand with this very hidden elastic waistband. Ah, uh, yes. You can't see it at all on the outside, and on the inside, all there is is this little strip of elastic that just gives you a couple extra inches of ease. I love that. That's nice. And especially if you kind of fluctuate and you know, it's a, it gives you a, a little extra room there when exactly. you need it. Exactly. Take so, Thanksgiving dinner, you're all set. Right, <laughs> you're good to go, yeah. Oh, that's great. Mm -hmm. I love it. I love the thought that has gone into all this. It makes such a big difference with uh, knowing that there are these kind of details and that you've really looked at uh, how clothes fit on bigger bodies and you've you know, responded accordingly. Well, I mean, hell, we, we browsed your site a lot and got a lot of inspiration <laughs> hearing the good and the bad that's out there and wanted to give something that was better. So uh, can you talk about some of the things that you did? Uh, I know we've got some shirts here and you've got some things to share with us. Just talk about um, how you approached uh, design for extended sizes. Sure. So what we noticed with a lot of competitors, again, was that it was more concerned with covering the body rather than fitting it well. And our customers um, have grown accustomed to expecting more from us in the realm of fit. So uh, we had to make a product we were really proud of and that fit well. So starting from the top with our woven shirts, um, we lowered the front neck drop significantly and added a little more to the total circ circumference so that it would be comfortable to wear all day. You can button it up to the top, no problem. We, on our casual shirts only, we um, increased the button size slightly just so everything would look correct proportionally. Um, and they have the added benefit of being a little easier to work. So what we did here was change our sleeve from a one piece to a two piece. And that's basically exactly what it sounds like. A normal shirt sleeve is one piece that's folded in half with a seam up the bottom. Um, that doesn't allow for much shape to be put in the sleeve. So here we have two pieces with a seam along the back of the arm. What it does is mimic the natural curve of the arm at rest and takes out a lot of that excess that cause the folding and billowing, et cetera. So you also work on pants, right? I do. What we changed here on our woven bottoms is the pitch, and essentially that is the angle from back to front, the way the pants sit on your body. Usually pants will sit higher up in the back than they do in the front, 
And if you're somebody who has a little extra around the middle, you tend to wear your pants underneath mm -hmm. your belly. So we wanted to just work with that and make the pants more comfortable. So we increase the amount of pitch so that they'll naturally be able to sit at that more extreme angle that people will wanna wear them at. We're also gonna be offering belts, obviously in the extended sizes to go with the pants. This is great. Uh, I'm excited to see what's coming next. I think uh, just seeing what you've launched with, we've got a lot more options here and uh, things that I think a lot of bigger guys are actually going to want to wear, so. I hope so. So now you know what went into designing extended sizes, but how do the clothes actually fit? Next week, we'll meet our friend Josh at a local guide shop and get him outfitted in some brand new looks from Bonobos.